Hello, Midi here from everything about Windows. Today we want to take a quick look at the new timeline feature, which was introduced 2017 at the build conference from Microsoft. Now in build 17063 we've got it. So you will see the task button is, has changed and when you click on it, you come to the timeline feature. The timeline feature records all your activities um, which you have done today uh, or yesterday or 30 days ago. So the timeline feature records all your activities which you have done 30 days ago. So if you scroll there, you will see activities from uh, web pages you have visited on Microsoft Edge, um, Word documents which you have worked on or other office documents. You will also see photos that you have opened um, or if when you have uh, searched for something in the Maps app. So um, you will see for example yesterday I've got 36 activities when I tap on it. They are now just listed chronological in a time order so I can see that what I have done um, beginning at 12 a.m. until 7 p.m. so each hour I can see the activities I've done and if I want to I can bo go back and now I see again the main activities um, I have a um, 15 inch display so I will see six and uh, up to six main activities if you have a larger display then you see more and for example you see that I've got or I've searched in the maps app for Microsoft I've tapped on it now and now it's open in the map app and you will see that it will go to the search which I have done some minutes ago and watch what was saved in the timeline so um, for example if you have searched on your tablet for destination for your holidays and you go to your main machine in your work room you can just look what you have done before also here uh, example with a word document I open it um, I've created it um, maybe 30 minutes 30 minutes ago and now I just open it to let's say continue the work I have done so um, let's wait a while and here you see the document um, yes that's a true message I hope you uh, subscribe to my channel and you enjoy my videos uh, and very thank you for the support for 60 sub subscribers I appreciate it a lot okay let's go on and here on the top you see all your opened windows that's the same like in the actual windows fall creators update so you can also open your desktops on the top or delete them that's everything the same and you can also drag and drop your opened app or program to another desktop also the same like in current windows versions nothing new so I think the timeline feature is a very productive uh, thing so um, if you have multiple devices with one Microsoft account you can go through all your activities you have done you can resume your work you can also just look ah okay what have I done yesterday uh, was it interesting or so so yeah that was um, a review but I want to show you a last thing in the settings so for all those of you which um, are scared of your privacy informations which are saved in the Microsoft Cloud for this timeline feature, you can go into the activity history and you can also turn it on or off. So if you don't want to use the timeline feature, you can just uh, use the switch and turn it off and you can also clear your data from your Microsoft account. So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, that would mean a lot to me. Bye!